Hi everyone, so in this tutorial, I'll show you and how you can test out your um, offer, um, course offer links inside Sagmatic so you don't have to like put in your actual card and just basically maybe um, refund yourself. So we actually have something called um, test cards provided by Stripe that we can use. These are just basically test like numbers that we can use if we want to test out um, checkout. This will also be applicable if you're doing one-stop order form inside Technetics, if you're selling like physical products, or maybe you have your course check out on an order form because maybe you have um, some affiliate marketing going on. So yeah, so these are just um, some of the, um, these are basically the list from Stripe for all of the test cards we can use. And then we can use any digits for the CVC and also the date. So yeah, so let's do it. So the very first thing that you need to do to test out a course checkout or a course offer in order for us to like check out the how the checkout works if you want to check out what will happen if someone like buys my course so like you know stuff like that so what we're going to do the very first thing that we need to do is basically create your offers right so here i'm currently on my offer page and what you need to do on the right section you see price click on edit price and just basically if if it's either a one-time payment of it, or it is a uh, what i call this recurring subscription please make sure that your payment mode is put on test if it's live you can put it on live but as of the moment let's just put it as, as a test because we want to test out how um the payment works and also just to give you a heads up um testing out um offers and basically like concept order form will also trigger um like actions and stuff on the workflow if you want to test out for example this exact course if you want to test out, to test out what the what are the emails um being sent out when someone signed up for the course you can also verify it um if, if even if you the checkout that you're going to do is just in the test mode so yeah, so for um so yeah, so that's all good. We already test uh put the price on test. What we're going to do is get the offer link. So I'll just copy the link here. And when you're testing stuff inside Technetics, please uh do it in uh in an oh sorry for that. Please do it in incognito because usually um your main browser has like cache and cookies from your uh Techmatics account. So just do it on incognito. Let me just paste my um, offer link. So this is how my offer link looks like. I'll just put in my email address. Maybe I'll use um, Febby. Let's see if, if I think Febby already has access to it. So maybe let's just do um, the Nats with an, a, um, an H. And then a full name would be, um, let's just do Natalie. And then tick on the checkbox, click on submit. And after that, this pop-up will show up. And as you can see, it's currently on a test mode because we're testing it out. So what, what we're going to do, the card number that we'll input here is a card number provided by the test card from Stripe. So head over to your um, Stripe. Let me just go here. Um, don't worry, I'll include this link to the uh, description of this tutorial. So for example, I'll just use the very first one, but you can definitely like, um, pick any of this like card numbers that you can find there. Let me head back here and then I'll just paste the test card that I got. Expiration date could be like any future date. So I'll just put in 1225 and then CBC would be any three digit number. And then you can just click on confirm payment. Let's just wait for that one to load. And yeah, that's it. So you see the car confirmation, right? Um, after you paid for something, the com confirmation will pop up. Uh, you can either, uh, depending on how you set up your offer, you can either um, maybe uh, click on that button and then go automatically to your dashboard so you can uh, start watching the courses and stuff like that. But in my case, I actually created an upsell for that exact offer. So this is what the upsell looks like. Uh, this is what we call... Um, what do you call this? A uh, one-click upsell. So um, I'll show you how the other one looks like, which is I think it is an in-app upsell. So this is a one-click upsell. It will automatically um, redirect the checkout 
to the next page after we pay for something um, for like, you know, for the absolute product that you have. So for example, if I'm interested in this product, I did not set it, set it up completely, but you can definitely have like full description on how um, uh, of your like course curriculum and stuff like that. So in my case, for example, I want to buy this upsell. If I'm interested with upsell, I'll buy it. You can just click on the checkout and the same thing will happen. Uh, this thing will pop up. You need to put in your test uh, card number because I put it also as a test mode. Put in any future um, uh, future dates for the expiration and any fee number for the CVC. And then just click on confirm payment. Um, let's just wait for that one to load. And as you can see, um, the purchase has been made through the test modes. And then when I click on view dashboard, um, yeah, so as you can see, these are now all of the courses I have access to through that offer or through that purchase that I made through the test. So yeah. And then um, the upsell that I showed you earlier is called an in-app, um, a one-click upsell, right? This one is called an in-app upsell. These are the upsells that is will automatically show up to the client portal or to the student's portal for them to be able to just basically buy the upsell from their course portal. So whenever, uh, because we have two tabs here, the all of the core, uh, I mean, this tab called all courses will show all of the courses, including the upsells, but the my courses will only show all the courses that they have ac um, access to. So this one is the upsell that we have and let's test it out. So yeah, as you can see, this is the upsell for the in-app. When I click on enroll for free, oh, sorry, this is a free product. So I can just enroll for free and automatically when I click on view dashboard and when I refresh this page, that exact um, upsell will now be unlocked and it will now be um, added to my courses automatically. So yeah, so I hope this tutorial is helpful. Please let us know in the comment box if you have any tutorial uh, tutorials that you want us to cover so we can work on that. So yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Bye.